Steve Nick then was trying to persuade the, the boundary up that it didn't actually go over. Didn't have much hope on it. <laughs> Steve Four feet a, over. Well, there's more. Grabs it out of the ruck. Taken out of his hands there by Harris. In goes Conley after the ball and umpire Ian Robinson will bounce the ball about 30 metres out from the Fitzroy goal. More. Against Mark Scott. Down to the ground it goes. It's grabbed by Zantuck. In fact, he let the ball go in the finish. And then stalemate, said the umpire, and he'll bounce it again. Peter Moore against Mark Scott. The ball bounced awkwardly. Wilson in there again. Shoving there. The free kick will go to Conley of Melbourne. Pushed out of the way. He looks for the hand pass across to Shane Zantuck, who's on his natural left foot. Looks for Healy and finds. Healy well out of position between the halfback flank and the wing. Kicks it up high. He's looking for McLean. McLean's eased out and the mark taken and the free kick given to Laurie. Parrish on the left foot goes out looking for Ruse, who's been one of Fitzroy's best players. He's pushed in the back. Up by Robinson. Sees Ick. Throwing his body around. Disagreeing, but there was never a doubt about it. Paul Ruse. Tremendous use of the body, Steve, by Ruse that he ducked back into Ick and Ick had to give away the free kick down to Quinlan. Quinlan punches it back to Carlson. Carlson has been a tremendous player for Fitzroy since coming across from Collingwood up towards the forward line. Grabbed by Zantuck across to Boland. Boland from centre half back ducks around Irwin. Streams up the centre of the ground. The hand pass finds Dixon. A oh, good attempt by Gotts to spoil. Up towards half orders. Grabbed by Nettlefold. Nettlefold a very high kick. A 60 metre one finds Quinlan. Stephen Smith once again shakes the head. What can I do about this? As Quinlan is 35 metres out from goal, 45 degree angle, and is lining up for goal number four. And he has already kicked three goals, six. So he's had, he had, he's had enormous use of the ball today. I'll say he has as he go with that familiar drop punt. Fires at the goals. It's really hit the top of the post. Or did it? It definitely did hit I the top must of be the seeing post. things. I must be seeing things. That definitely hit the top of the post, and the goal up guys paid it a goal. What an amazing decision oh, yes. he has. Smith has turned to the goal on fire. Smith has turned to the goal on fire. Absolutely amazing decision. It appeared to hit the top of the left hand post. It's still shaking, or is that the breeze? But that it was, definitely hit it. No well, that's goal that. number four to Bernie Quinlan. <laughs> Bernie will never get an easier goal than that ever. The ball back in the centre of the ground. Fitzroy lead 109 to 36. Giving Melbourne a fearful bath here. Fitzroy back into attack yet again. Looking for Harris out there and Boland. The ball swings around and will beat Bernie Quinlan towards the boundary line. It always amazes me that you can see a, a ball hit the top of the post from where we are, 80 metres away, and the goal up was right next to it and can't see it. That's a, incredible, isn't it? The throw in. Forward pocket for the Lions. Mark Scott goes for the tap over to Ruse. Ruse has already kicked three runs into goal. Lines on up, goal number four. Great goal to Paul Ruse. What a game he's played here at the junction this afternoon. And Fitzroy have really given Melbourne a fearful shellacking this afternoon. Fitzroy, 16 goals, 19, 125. Lead Melbourne, five goals, six, 36. Sorry, 115 to 36. And that margin is quite substantial, Peter. Well, it's an unbelievable performance by Melbourne. A, a pitiful performance, in fact. In the second quarter, uh, to let Fitzroy kick six goals into a howling north wind is unheard of here at uh, the Junction Oval. Here's Rodney Wright trying to get away with the ball under the left foot, up towards half court. Out come that strong Fitzroy defence again. That was Gary Pert. A long hand pass finds Carlson. Carlson across to Logan. They're looking good, Fitzroy. A beautiful kick. Looking down there for Mark Scott. Up he goes over the back. Grabbed by Quinlan. He fires at the goal. Swings. Four goals, seven to Bernie Quinlan. 